Hey YouTube, this is Tracy Vaporella, and I have a review on the IPv3. It is an awesome box mod. Um, it's my favorite whatsoever. And I have on my MXV2 on here, and this is how she vapes. Stick with me, and I'll bring the camera down and show some specifics on how she works. So, hope you stick around. Alright everybody, this is what you have when you get it, the, the box and everything, <laughs> and then you have your um, mod, um, mine has a wrap on it, uh, it won't look like this, it will either be black or silver, and then you get your warranty card, your screwdriver with screws, your certificate of authenticity, and your instructions. So yeah, that's what you get. Oh, and, and then you get the, um, the USB. I'm not taking that out, but that's for updating, and mine's already updated, so I don't have to worry with that. But, alright, let's get down to the mod mod. Okay, these normally come with um, certain little Allen screws, but I had Phillips head put in here for easier stuff, so I could just use whatever screwdriver. And uh, yeah. okay, there we go. All right, this is what's on the inside. Got two 18650 batteries. And your little cute IPV thing on here. And that's really about all inside of this. I um not really much to show in that department. But let's see. If I could get these screws in, we would have a really good day. Good God! It's really not that hard. It's just trying to do it on the camera is like pretty crappy. <clears throat> oh my goodness. Okay. Sweet. All right, now we got them back in. All right, and then you do the five clicks to cut it on. Okay. And now, you wait. All right. And then it has the five pre-settings. All right, there's the first one. I have it at 65, and then 80, 100, 130, and then 165. But if you don't want to do that, you know, the pre-settings, you can always go back and with the clicks or just hold it down. And it will go up and down. Just like that. And what I'm using on it today, let's see, I'm going to bring it down because that would just be too much. I'll bring it down to about 80. What I'm using on it today is my Mutation XV2. It's a little juicy, but it gets the job done. And so, that's my build. 20 gauge Nichrome. I believe it was 5 reps. Came out to 0 .08. And that's another reason why I like this. It's because you can build low on it. Oh, and we'll see how it fires. Woo! That's at 80. And let's see, we'll bump it. I'll bump it all the way up to 165 just to show you. All right. Here's 165. 
yeah that's a bad mama jammy anyways um this is about all that i wanted to say about it i'm pretty impressed with this box it, uh, and the battery life the batteries last twice last twice twice as long as normal as long as you keep it on